Greetings, Shine Excel members and respected listeners. Uh, this is another important um, instruction or announcement. Um, as you all know, uh, we are having to change uh, the payment system from BTC to USDT. It already has been explained to you the reasons and uh, it's not uh, even the choice of the company. Uh, they're having to do this because the other systems are jammed up and it's almost impossible to make the payments on time. Uh, so uh, it uh, uh, came to a situation that the company had to find an alternative and uh, this is the uh, uh, better uh, alternative. So uh, one of the, uh, a lot of you already know this and uh, a lot of you have uh, already updated your wallets and some of you are in the process of doing so. However, one of the problems uh, is a lot of people are opening a USDT wallet on the Ethereum network, which starts with OX. Uh, that is not uh, acceptable. Uh, the Shine Excel wants you to please open your USDT wallet on the Tron network which starts with TR or uh, Tango at least T. It starts with T. Um, and again we're having this problem uh, people are uh, you know frustrated not getting paid but it's, it's just uh, um, a little bit complicated because people are doing sending their wrong wallets. Uh, the admin team trying to process the payments and uh, we're just going around the circle a little bit at the moment. Uh, but in time everything will settle down please have a little patience you know it is a bit of a change and it does take a while to settle down um, you know it'll probably take a week or two for everybody to settle into the new system anything new is you know a little bit challenging uh, it's part of our human nature we don't like change uh, it's understandable um, but you know it's something that needs to be done and uh, those some people I, uh, we are hearing they're not too happy about being paid in uh, USDT they want BTC uh, practically as we have already explained it is difficult at the moment uh, but uh, those of you who know USDT will understand it is a much better medium of payment and the people who don't know as soon as you will get to know in a couple of weeks time as you get used to it you will understand it is a much better medium of payment because it is a stable currency it does not fluctuate and change during the payment period because sometimes uh, with btc sometimes if it takes a long time for it to come through to you then by the time you receive it it's gone down by a few dollars uh, and if it's a large amount it can go down by you know uh, uh, quite a significant amount and then you'll be not happy you'll be saying how come i received less but in reality the btc price has gone down since the company has made the payment and uh, it took a time so with uh, with usdt you don't have all those problems you will get exactly what you withdraw and what the company has paid you it will not go down in value furthermore uh, the benefit of one another benefit of USDT is um, you can exchange it to BTC at any time and you can get a better deal. For example, if the company has paid you, let's say, uh, when the BTC price was really high, okay, then once you got your USDT, you can hold on to it and wait for the uh, BTC price to go down a little bit and when it goes down a little bit then you can buy in you can exchange your USDT for BTC and thereby you will gain some more extra BTC with your USDT so there are several benefits and uh, as you get to know it as you understand it you will notice that and you I think you will appreciate that uh, in, in time so as for now uh, we wanted to make uh, clear and I'll show this again I've done a video previously where I've explained this and uh, I'm just going to reiterate some of those stuff here. Um, here is the Polonix, uh, Polonix or Polonix whichever way you want to pronounce it uh, network. It's very very easy to use, uh, very simple to use. Uh, it's uh, you know you don't need no you don't need, even need any id to open it all you need is an email address and a password that's all you need to open it uh basically you can just you can see the sign up just go into uh, uh, you can just open it in the uh, google uh, just type in polonix it will open up and when it opens up you'll give it the option to sign up so here you got the sign up you can just click sign up and it will take you uh literally just a few minutes to open an account 
uh, all you need is an email address and a password and of course you can uh, do your ID verification and all that stuff that's if you want to buy put some dollar or some pounds or whatever uh, and buy you know deal in f uh, fiat currency then you'll have to uh, do your ID verification but if you're just dealing in a crypto you don't need it all you need is the email and a password so it's very simple very quick to set up now uh, the reason why the company would like you to or encouraging you to do this because they themselves use this a lot and they find it very simple, very efficient, uh, and uh, they would recommend and prefer that you use this. Uh, but it is available uh, on other networks as well, Binance and others. But again, I'll show you here. So once you log in, uh, just click on this. If you're if you got an account, it's simple. Just log in. So it's opening up and once you have uh, logged in uh, okay then all you need to do is click on where it says wallet here okay click on wallet there you go okay and then as you know whatever currency if you want to get the address out of it you need to uh, select deposit which will uh, give you the option or, or get, uh, take you to the address. So we click on deposit and then it gives you the list uh, what you want to deposit, what you want to bring in. So here uh, we have got USDT uh, you can type it in as well. You can type it in. You can type it in here USDT if you want. Uh, what I think we saw it here earlier on. Yeah, USDT. Okay, so as soon as you click on USDT, okay, you'll see it comes up with this window here all right and if you scroll down if you scroll down a little bit all right so please just uh, note this and be careful with a lot of you have selected deposit on the ethereum network and the company is not dealing with ethereum network uh, the fees are extortionate the gas fees are extortionate on uh, ethereum network what we want to do is select the Tron network. All right. Can you see this here? Okay. Whatever network, Binance, or wherever you're using, please select deposit on Tron. All right. So you want the Ether uh, USDT to be deposited on the Tron uh, via the Tron network. So just select on Tron. If you click that, boom. Simple. It has given you the address. So you can just as you know, I'm sure most of you know this process. You can copy it here. You got the QR code here. You can scan it. All right. So there's various ways of doing it. And it's simple as that. All you do is just click on here, copy, make a note of this address, by the way, so you don't lose it. You don't forget it. All right. Very simple. Click here on copy. Go to your. Uh, I'll just quickly do that again. But you, all of you, I'm sure, know this by now. If you just go to any. Uh, Uh, just go to any account all right uh, you know this process you go to uh, uh, profile view there's your profile there it's available somewhere okay. that's the profile there all right once you're in your profile you know the rest of it all right payment details and here i've got still my previous um, address on here so this has been updated yet so basically if you haven't gotten anything there here's the tab you need to click on this tab which will allow you to edit this box here okay and put in your address so if you already got a, a btc address there you need to delete that and simply put your new address in uh, scroll down uh yeah this yeah you have to do that first and then usually you know you scroll down it has a, a update uh tab on there you go to update it will send you an email update that so you need to do that please asp uh payments are being jammed they're being logged uh you know delayed because people have sent the wrong wallet address please go back change your address to uh the tron network select the tron network 
do the ASP. And uh, please just have a bit of patience. It is a system update. It's taking, you know, it's obviously it's a quite a big changeover. It will take a little while, but don't worry. Even if you didn't get your payment this week, it's not going anywhere. It's on the network. You will get your money. Just, just relax. Everything will be fine. All right. And uh, all the best to you. I hope everything goes smooth for you. Thank you. Bye now.